hello guys and welcome back to this video so in today's video tutorial we are going to be looking at how to use the jump x exchange to trade features all right so jump x is actually a new cryptocurrency trading exchange where you can actually trade features all right you can trade um you know spot and you can equally copy traders right if i go to the copy trading option right here you'll see here that there are a whole lot of professional traders okay um that you can actually copy their trades while they do the work for you and all of that all right i uh, will do a separate video on the, um you know copy trading and all of that all right but today i want to look at features trading and there's one particular feature which i'm going to make a separate video on on the jumpers exchange which is this one thousand and seventy seven x leverage so it means that you can actually use up to one thousand and seventy seven x leverage to trade features all right i'll make a separate video on this um it is actually quite risky but if you get it right it is good for scalping if you get it right you make a whole lot of money using this option right here but what we want to focus on is this um, USDM features option. The copy trade option is if you are a pro, a pro trader, okay, this is how you assess the copy trading interface. But we are going, let's assume that you're a normal user here. So we're going to focus on the USD uh, M features option. Once you click on it, this is what the interface looks like, okay, on the web browser. I'm using the browser for this, all right? And this is where you have your order book. This is where you have the statistics for that particular token you've selected. Okay, for instance, if I want to change from BTC to any other token, I can just go ahead and click on the BTC and I can select from the list of, you know, tokens right here. Okay, and then this is where you have your chart where you can do your analysis, your time frames up here and all of that. And then you can add indicators as well. And then on the right here is where you can actually adjust your leverage. Okay, your margin mode, your leverage. And this is your trading panel where you can actually go ahead and carry out all your trades. As you can see, I have some trades that are currently running right here okay so what you do is first you come in here okay uh, let's say we want to trade btc and from the look of things let's say we want to go ahead and open a long trade on btc if for instance i want to add an indicator to this i can go ahead and click on the indicator option once i click on the indicator option okay this dialog box pops up so let's just say we want to add the ema indicator okay so i just go ahead and type ema and you see the moving average exponential go ahead and click on that and that indicator will be added to your chart okay and we are currently looking at the chart on a daily time frame so i can go ahead and um, go to the setting of this indicator okay click once you over over i click on that setting icon and the length of this indicator i want to change it to 200 okay i can change the color if i want and all of that to, to do that i'll go to style and then i can change the color right here to whatever i want okay uh, maybe to this orange color or whatever and then i can make the indicator ticker once i click on that color option you see right here, if i click you see that the indicator becomes you know very thick and all of that and um, i go ahead and click on okay so you can actually use this now to start let's go to the four hours time frame All right, so you can use this now to make decisions in the market and start taking trees. Let me equally look at the one hour time frame. All right, so you see that the view of this indicator on the one hour time frame is quite different. So right here, I feel like going long. Okay, maybe we're entering a long trade here. And, um, you know, with the hope that this will continue, maybe we'll get to 58 or 60 K and all of that. All right. So what I want to do, um, after you've done your analysis and the rest, make sure that I think the first thing to actually do is to make sure that you have some funds here. If you don't have money yet, once you sign up for an account, the link to sign up for a jumpers account, okay, will be in the video description. All right. And, uh, once you come in here, the next thing you need to do is just to go ahead okay and um transfer some funds right into your features account so if i click on this icon right here this is the icon that allows you to transfer funds okay so you can transfer from your wallet all right to your officials wallet okay and vice versa so once you do that make sure that there are funds here the next thing you want to do is to select the margin mode do you want to trade with cross margin or isolated margin go ahead and select any option that you prefer but i, I prefer the you know isolated option and then you want to select the leverage okay you can go to as high as 125x leverage this is the normal features trading okay the other one that you can do 1077 is a separate thing entirely 
so that one i will make a video on that actually showing you how to use that to make some money for yourself all right then i'll go ahead and add let's say we want to buy btc when it gets down to 56 five six okay that's 56 five six three we'll go ahead and put 56 okay five six three right here and then you can type the amount of btc you want to trade for instance if i go ahead and type one right here in this space so if i go ahead and type a one right there you'll see right here okay that it will cost me about two thousand dollars all right i don't have that amount of money so basically we can use this slider all right to do uh let's say like five percent ten percent of whatever capital we have here all right so if i go ahead and slide that here if i want to open a long trade you'll see what it will cost me so the margin okay i'm going to use for this trade will be around ten dollars and then for a short trade it will be around eight dollars okay so if you're okay with that the next thing you want to do is to go ahead and then open either a long or a short trade okay if i go ahead and open a long trade because the price is currently below the current market price it's going to be a pending trade so you go ahead and open long and then click on confirm long here you see the summary of your trades okay now that you've confirmed your long if i come back to down here to where it says open orders all right right here you will see the options where it says open orders you can see all my open orders both tps and all of that they are all in that um area there okay so all i just need to do right here is just to go ahead and click on that open order option and you will see the btc trade we just open right here okay this one here is a btc trade we open and i have other pending orders okay for long and all of that then for tps you can see all my tps and sl um, option right here okay then for the limit orders you see all of them right here okay and once your trade is triggered you will see them here at the open order option okay now if i want to close any of this trade if i want to close any of this trade all i just need to do is to go ahead and use this quick close option and it will close the entire position but let's say ftm has given us about nine dollars okay with a 92 percent profit okay and we want to close half of this we want to close partial of this trade all we need to do is to click on the advanced close option okay and then we have the option to do at the current market price or do limit all right this is the current market price and let's say i want to close 50 percent of that i'll go ahead and select 50 percent and then click on confirm okay you will see that it will go ahead once the price gets to that one will just set up okay this is the current price is slightly actually below what we just set right now so if the price gets up there all right to what we just set right now this will close half of this position okay and then my margin here that is ten dollars five dollars will be reduced out of it the profit that is nine okay four or point something will be reduced out of it and the remaining one will be the one that i'm left with okay then i can then if you want to move stop loss to break even all you just need to do if i move my slider so if i go ahead and move my slider this is where you see the entire position okay for tps and sl if you want to set partials this is you use this other option okay uh if you want to set partials you use this other option but if you want to close the entire position you use it okay so here you can go ahead and adjust your stop loss by moving your stop loss to break even stop loss is already at break even okay i've closed half of this position already and i'm doing that already again to show you okay just for the purpose of this demonstration to show you how to use all of these features okay so you can see our pending order showing up on the chart here i can go ahead and adjust this if for instance i want to move it down here i can adjust that right and you see that automatically all right it moves to that area if i want to move it to the current market price i can equally click drag this up and down the same thing if you set tps and sl you can just start dragging them on the chart here to position them where you want them to be all right so it's pretty much simple yeah make sure that you join us on telegram to learn more on our daily lives and all of that where we we'll teach you how to use trading view how to do technical analysis and all of that join us on telegram okay and if you want to learn how to trade there is a step-by-step -step course that we have recorded already for you the link will be in the video description so make sure you go check that out okay so sign up for a jump as i can make a deposit get the welcome bonus and start trading on the jump as i can and the next thing i want to do here is to show you how to use this option for you know a thousand and seventy seven x leverage guys if you utilize this very well you'll make a lot of money from it okay if you utilize this very well you make a lot of money from it 
and if if you don't utilize it very well definitely you lose a lot of money from it okay so we'll make a separate video on that make sure that it, you subscribe to the channel okay hit that notification bell so that whenever i publish that video you'll be the first to be notified and once again if you want to learn more the link to join us on telegram will be in the video description if you have questions if there's anything you don't understand you can always use the comment section or join us on telegram okay and other like-minded people they will be there to help you on the telegram chat all right that is it for this video i'll see you guys in the next video